Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video, we're going to be doing a tutorial on how to create a custom profile picture like Sounds Utilities. So, this is meant for your bot, but you can also do it with your profile picture or whatever else you want to do. And um, now, um, you just need to get the two resources, which is the photo editor link and the image. So the image is in the description. It will be a media discord app image and you're just going to click on that. And then you can uh, view the image from a source and you can right click on it and copy it or save it. Um, you're going to save it and name it whatever you want. Next, you're going to go to the link in the description, which is Photop. This is basically a clone of Photoshop, but it's just free and online. And even if your computer is literally like absolute trash, your, um, your thing should still load and you can run it. So um, once you're done with that, then you can just open from computer once you get to the site. Uh, click your image file and then after that, you'll be brought to this. So now let's change the color. To do that, there's an adjustment layer thing right here. Um, it's in the bottom right, sort of. So you're gonna click it, it's like a half dark circle, half light circle. And you have many options here. We're only gonna be using hue and saturation. Next, select colorize. And now you can select the color of the whole thing. You can just drag. Um, for example, if mine is like this color around like the theme of it, and I'll pick this. I know that my main bot is green, so I would just do like something like this. And then if you don't like like the brightness or saturation, you can always just tone it down a bit. And um, yeah, then you're done. Um, I would choose maybe like a purple one for my test bot. And I can drag down the saturation or up it. And lightness, maybe a bit less like that. And then um, you can click the properties tab here to get rid of it. Next, we're gonna add some text. So you can either click T or select it on the left. And then uh, choose 550 pixels, so you can't actually drag more than 150. But if you want, you can use a custom one and type it out yourself. And um, yeah, now it will be the good size for your bot profile picture. So my initials are JU, Joey's Utilities. Next, we can select this tool. You can either click V or click it from the left. And now you can center this. So as you can see, there's two lines that are perpendicular. Um, and that will mean that it's in the center of the image. So now we can either change the color or add drop shadow. If you want to change the color, just go here and then control A this. And the color is right here and you can change it to whatever you want. I'm going to keep it white. Let me center the skin. There we go. Okay. And now we can add drop shadow to this. So just um, select your text layer, which is should be like at the top around. I'll right click it and go to blending options. Next, drop down to drop shadow, and then this is my settings um, that I use for all my text, like thumbnails and stuff. So you can copy this if you want, but you can also play around with it um, if you don't like it currently. And then you just click OK, and then boom, you're done. And to save this and change your bot profile picture, I'm just going to go to File, Export As, and then select PNG, and save it as whatever you want, and then go to Discord Developer Portal, and then you can change your bot profile picture from there. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. I know this was very short, but a lot of people were requesting this. So, um, I appreciate all the support. Sorry for the lack of uploads. I just got a new computer. As you can see, it's not crashing or anything. So that's good. And, um, yeah, I'll um, upload a bit more in the future. So, yeah, I'll see you guys. Peace.